Um, next person I made was Thanos. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's pretty good. I uh, I just only the uh, blue marker on this yellow life jacket thingy uh, didn't work so well, only because um, the uh, it, it'll turn out green, obviously, but it's a little bit darker of a blue. Uh, and then the face, even though I drew gray, uh, I actually I used a purple sharpie, the light purple sharpie on um, the uh, yellow skin. It kind of turned out this greenish, grayish kind of shape, um, which is pretty good. And I mean, I could use that for a scroll also if I wanted to, so that's a plus. Uh, the helmet was pretty easy. Just did a label on, on this blue helmet. So yeah, and then I drew abs uh, and uh, muscles on the rest of the body, like that. Uh, it doesn't really matter much, because I mean this is covering most of it, but the arms and legs I gave definition. Um, so yeah, there we go. Uh, next person, I made Bullseye. Classic version. His this thing right there is a little lopsided, and it always annoys me. But whatever. Uh, we got the. Uh, I gave him a helmet thing right here. And I did a label maker on it. Uh, I just thought it would be easier to do that than have it actually be on the head. Uh, and therefore, and then you can take it off because there's a face on the other side of this. Yeah, and I drew on um, the face, I made it a custom face, custom body, I made a label, and then just black and white. Uh, speaking of a pretty simple uh, custom black and white, I had a um, request to do Punisher figure, so I made Punisher. This is his uh, classic version. I did not really know what the 616 version was, Who I can't remember who... Uh, commented on it uh, to, for me to make Punisher, but uh, you can just, you can say so in the comments. Um, but I, I looked up the 616 Punisher, I didn't really see a huge difference from the normal Punisher. And the Ultimate, I think, is just without sleeves um, and kind of a cloak. So I can give him a black cloak if I want, but this is kind of the normal classic Punisher. Um, I just gave him this this head. It looks most like it would be him. And then these are his guns. Um, so yeah, there's Punisher. Uh, next is Thor. You guys have obviously already seen my Thor figure. Um, but I made an Ultimate Thor. And for that, if you have a normal Thor... Oops. Uh, you just take off the head, take off the cape, um, so you're left with this, but then what you're going to do is you're going to want to get completely black pants, like so, um, and then I, what I do is I use White Queen's arms, Take them off. Take them off her body. Like that. Um, and then I take these arms off. Um, and then I have her arms. And they have white hands on them. But what you're going to do is you're going to use, you're going to put black hands on them. So that's like that. And then you put the head on, you've got classic, uh, sorry, <laughs> Ultimate Thor. And you got his hammer, of course. It's, his hammer is different in the Ultimates, but for, for this, you can just keep his hammer the same. Um, so yeah, that would be Ultimate Thor. Just gather all the pieces around here. Um, and yeah, 
yeah, so next person who I've made is Black Widow. I made her comic series outfit. Um, I know the uh, womanly parts are a little bit lopsided or not centered or something, but it doesn't really matter. Um, I had a Princess Leia face that I made look a tiny bit meaner. Looks a little weird, I know, but, you know, whatever. Uh, I made the body like that, and then there wasn't enough room for the belt, so I made a new label for the belt, and I put it a little bit below there. Um, yeah, and then just the rest of it was black. Um, so yeah, that's her. Uh, next person, I made Dormammu. just gave him a cape. I gave him this uh, knight's armor thing. This is the uh, Dracula cape, by the way. Um, I used that orange head that I had before, and I drew on it with the face. Because, uh, yeah, it kind of has that black face and then the fire all around it. And then what I did was I cut off these two fire pieces at the ends so I could put them in the cape. Like so. So it kind of looks like he has fire coming out of there. So it looks like that. Um, so yeah, that would be Dormammu. Oops. Um, and then, oh, it's just Bruce Banner in his normal outfit. I don't know if you guys have seen that yet. But just, yeah. And then the last but not least, in honor of the Captain America movie coming out, I made a new Red Skull, movie version Red Skull. Um, I did the body custom, just whole black body, and I did a label on there, uh, exactly like the movie uh, image, and then I redid the head completely to make it look like the movie. This will focus. Ah, hate this camera sometimes. There we go. All right, it's kind of working. So yeah, that's his uh, Red Skull, and he has his gun, uh, but then he also has the uh, this hat, if he needs it, just like that, um, and then also, also, um, another thing I can do is I can use Quicksilver's head, This head and Bruce Banner's hair, which is this hair, and I can have him in the human mask that he has on. If anybody's seen the trailer and knows about that, he has a human mask over his red skull face, and so he kind of looks like that. Um, so, yeah. And then he takes off the mask, and he, of course, is Red Skull. So, yeah. That'll be my new Red Skull figure.